Okay, chapter three of Nancy Drew, Codes and Clues. As usual, we begin by picking outfits for our heroes. We need an artistic disguise. Very artistic, okay. Whoa, like it? Uh, I don't know about that. Whoa, what? I love it. Okay, Bess. Uh-huh, kind of messy. Ooh, hippie style. Uh, yeah, let's go with the hippie style. And George? Very messy. <laughs> what? And this. Uh, let's, 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 let's go with these outfits. Let's go with these crazy outfits. Nobody will find that suspicious. Yeah, yeah, those are totally normal outfits that eight-year-old girls wear all the time. Okay, now let's meet Jack Hansen, our current suspect. Are you Jack Hansen? Yeah, who are you? I'm Nancy Drew. These are my friends, Bess and George. Do you know someone named Tyler? Sure, why? In an email you sent to Tyler, you mentioned that you want to take G apart. What's G? How do you know that? Hey, I'm not giving up any tech fair secrets here. Are you a spy? No, I'm not a spy. I'm a detective. We're just trying to help Alexa with her project. Yeah, her missing project. So what's that got to do with me? Let's check it out. I love how Nancy's like, hey, in that personal email you sent, which I, I totally read, you sent this suspicious thing. Care to explain? Like, Nancy, seriously, you probably shouldn't be revealing you've been reading this guy's private emails. Oh, that was pretty simple. That was a pretty simple challenge. Let's see what these things are. Well, this is a pretty mysterious Mystery note, note is mysterious. Where did this glue come hmm, from? A bottle of glue in the art room. Suspicious. Just like the sticky cover at the tech Oh, room. and everything is still sticky. Perhaps the glue is what made things sticky. Why is Alexa's name tag here? Hmm. Yeah, and apparently Alexa was here. Okay, Alexa was here. And I think those are all our suspects. Wait, 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 wait. We've got another suspect in the next chapter, but we we haven't actually gotten to the next chapter yet. How did Alexa's tech fair name tag wind up in the art room? We need to talk to Jack again. Aha, uh -huh, yeah, yeah. We definitely need to talk to Jack, the guy who's making the cool surfing symbol with his hand. Jack, were you in the gym earlier? Why? Because this is the name tag from Alexa's tech fair table. Did you have something to do with it showing up here? Let's investigate. Help yourself. <laughs> we don't even give him a chance to answer our questions. Bess is like, let's investigate! I'm like, Bess, Bess, we, 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 we wanted to hear answers to our questions, right? Maybe? Aww. Not giving the suspect a chance to explain themselves. Is this an Encyclopedia Brown mystery? Uh, I don't know. So let's see what these things are. We've got a, a name tag. Is someone printing new name tags? Somebody making fake name tags? Hmm, maybe that's how Alexa's name tag was found here. These are the plans for the Gustav Project. And this is the important clue. Somebody totally stole the blueprints for the Gustav project. Oh my gosh. A blueprint for the Gustav project. It's Alexis' project. Let's check out the media room where the blueprint was printed. I like how George whispers the first sentence and then gets excited about the clue. Oh, George. A media room. Remember when I had to print out the blueprint plans for our puppy? Yeah, so we could submit it to the judges. <gasps> These are Alexa's plans for the Gustav project. But we had to send the plans in two weeks ago. Exactly. Someone needed these plans today. Let's investigate. Hmm. Why would somebody need the plans today? I don't know. I'm sure we're gonna find out, though. Uh, 
Let's see. Bunny rabbit over here. More plans. And a uh, pink thingy there. And that thingy. Cool. Picture perfect. Jack and Tyler are working whoa, together. Whoa, whoa. Jack and Tyler are working together. Two of our suspects are in cahoots. A horse? These are plans for a Suzy Q snack station. Hmm, a horse feeding project, huh? Sounds suspiciously similar to the missing dog feeding project. Hmm, there's another set of plans for a project called Suzy Q Snack Station. Suzy Q. There's that name again. What on earth does a horse named Suzy Q have to do with the snack station? I don't know, but it's one crazy looking tech project. It's crazy, all right. Let's go see if Tyler is more helpful than Jack. I'm pretty sure anybody would be more helpful than Jack. I don't know which way to go find Tyler, but we can't go out the exit. Wait, they're not allowed to block doors. That's not even safe. Hurry up! Let's check this hallway for clues and get out of here! You're right, Bess. Let's investigate. Yeah. Blocking the exit? That's not even safe. Like, not even. Let's see if we can find all these items. This thingy. Uh... That thing. Oh, 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 hmm. That looks. That looks. That looks like a very important clue right there. And the final thingy we need is this. Woohoo! Great work. This will come in handy. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I, I, I guess. Found another part. The text message says. G has got to go. Hmm, but what does that refer to? This must be Jack's phone. Jack's pretty careless with his gadgets, isn't he? First the laptop, and now his phone. Bess, don't lean against those boxes. They don't look sturdy. <laughs> Bess! <sighs> Seriously, Bess? Come on, Bess. We can't move all these boxes, and the truck is blocking the door. I have an idea. Let's send our puppy through these boxes and code him to bark up a storm. And get help! Good thinking, George. Let's get that bark command working. And get us out of here, please! Okay, so we have a new bark command, uh, the little red thingy. Bark command to kick objects out of the way. Use the bark command to bark. No, oh. Nancy just explained for me, so I didn't have to. Okay. Right, let's have the puppy go down. Hmm, looks like the puppy's gonna have to crawl for a bit, so let's have the puppy crawl four times. Okay, so here you want to kick a box, jump to get the star, uh, then kick, jump, kick, jump. Oh, I probably should have done that in a loop. It looks like we're just repeating the same action over and over again. Okay, now jump down, jump up, jump down. Now go forward and bark. You can do it, Deirdre. Yay! Brilliant! 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 Ooh, and I got a charm! Nice! Is someone there? Alexa? Is that you? You guys are lucky I was walking by. You sure know how to make your puppy bark. We were on our way to find Tyler. Tyler Wright? I just saw him in the music room. Okay, so, um, the charms in the bottom left-hand corner, uh, you get charms, uh, just for doing things in this game, like finding a clue, for actually beating the game, for not using hints, and uh, let me see, found clues.
Rose, did the obstacle courses, got every charm, tried every outfit, got pictures, and played the game multiple times. Okay. Yeah, so those are the charms. Those are charms. That's how charms work in this game. And in the next video, uh, let's do this brand new Deirdre puppy challenge, which opened up.